Vibes, and now tuning on to Music Police on the XY Planet. And this week we're rolling with one of the most excellent, immaculate, I tell you, I cannot exaggerate, one of the best video directors that Ghana has ever produced. And guess who that is? <laughs> Your Skyface in the building. That's what it is. These are the guys that make things happen, you know. And you don't really get to see them that much. So, Skype, what's, up? what's going on now? Clap me. Hey, what's good? What's everything good? cool, everything cool. Everything. Please, can you let these people know your Skyface, his real name, who he is, and what he's about? Um, I'm Isaac Mensa. That's my real name. Okay. I'm a creative director. Basically, been doing music videos all this while. But aside music videos, we do... Uh, commercials. Okay. We started movie last year, so maybe this year we'll be doing movies too as well. All right. So uh, since when have you been shooting music videos? Um, I think since 2010. 2010. Yeah, 2010. Yeah. That's more like an, an eight-year-old career. Yeah. Sure. Wow, that's nice. Eight-year-old career. So how 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 did it start? Like. You just thought one day that you're going to be a video director or maybe somebody prompted you or stuff? I think um, it's a passion. Okay. And then it developed into a career. So I didn't start like, I want to be a music video director. I just had passion for cameras. Okay. And then I have love for music too as well. So I, since I couldn't sing, I just wanted to find the balance, how to be in the music business. And I think I figured like, okay, let me just do music videos since I like cameras and I like music as well. So where did you learn how to shoot videos? Did it just come up to you that you could just pick up the camera and just shoot or? I just, I just picked up the camera one day. And then at that time, I think we were just trying, I have a few friends who did music at the time. So we were just trying something and then it came out good for the very first time. Wow. I was like, okay, I think I can learn more. So basically everything is through YouTube videos and online tutorials okay. so. Which job was your big break? Uh, I think it will be um, I won. Okay. I won Miss You. I think that's around 2011. Okay. 2011. And I think at that time, he was, I think, one of the biggest reggae down soul artists. Okay. So I think after that, he, okay, he was the um, mainstream, the first mainstream artist I worked with at the Work time. With, okay. Yeah, and I, I think I gained a lot of recognition from that video. So everything followed from there. How much would you call it for a video? When we get a song and we listen, and then I sit down with the team, we come up with the idea, and that's when we roughly knew that, okay, fine, with this kind of idea, let's try this kind of budget. It's going to work because we need this, we need that, we need that. Okay. But there are some budgets we don't do. Because definitely it's going to affect the output of the work. Uh, yes, that's the kind of, what, what kind of budget, like what's the least, what's the least crap that you can say, take? Like, uh, we could do any budget at all. You can give me 100 cities. Okay. If it's going to work, I'm going to do it. But right now, you have a lot of people complaining about picture quality. Okay. Therefore, we can't use certain cameras for 2018 jobs. You have to always step up. Actually, I said now, shoot a free video for somebody. Yeah, we, we, I think as, um, as our social responsibility, uh, me and my team, at least uh, at the end of every three months, we pick randomly. And sometimes the people doesn't even know that's what we are doing. Okay. Randomly we pick some up and coming artists wow. who is doing well. And like, okay, we want to shoot a video for you. You understand? Okay. But roughly, you know, you have to come up with some of the things we need to do the video because I believe that if you really want to succeed you have to at least sacrifice do you consider yourself a star oh no nah. can I be a star I'm not a star you're not a star I'm just trying to understand so uh, how does the industry actually treat video directors in your own words okay I think um, I think I've been I've been busy focusing on myself and my career so I don't really see I don't really see um how the industry really treats because I'm a simple person. Okay. I'll not take so much time to dress up when I have to when I want to go out. Okay. 
So I don't see whether if you go somewhere, they're going to be like, oh, that's that. But I think um, we, are, we, we, we are being treated well. That's, that's what I'm saying. Now the VGMA is, is around the corner. What are your expectations for it? Um, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, um, I, I appreciate our worth. Okay. I appreciate our worth because it's, it's a kind of motivation. Okay. But I'm not kind of an award freak. Okay. So whenever there is, there is an award, I don't even know the categories where videos fall. Okay. If I hear my video have won an award, it's okay. But so, I don't so really. would you say in this contest that you don't know the kind of video that you're good at? The kind of videos I'm good, good at. Good at, yeah. Um, I, I always want to stay versatile. Okay. Yeah, I, because I've, I've shot weddings, I've shot gospel videos, I've shot secular songs, I've shot... I've tried everything. Okay. And I did it on purpose. Okay. Just to at least gather a little knowledge about everything. Everything. On a scale of ten, how would you how would you rate uh, Ghana video directors globally? I think Ghana video directors are doing like nine. Like nine. Wow. Yeah. That's a great score. Very good. Um, it's not because of our quality that's why we are doing nine. Okay. But looking at the resources available to us. Okay. And the quality we are producing. We are doing, I think, even more than nine. I don't want to give the number 10 because that was so biased. <laughs> yeah, yeah, But we okay. are doing very well. Even because okay. most of the time, you compare Ghana music videos to Nigeria music videos. And then even in Nigeria, just here in Nigeria, they have a lot of resources as compared to Ghana. So if you are in Ghana and you can still do something that can be compared to... I, I would like to, I'd like to ask what kind of resources? Um, like yeah. Money, location, everything. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. So what particular artist artist have you found trouble working with that's giving you hell while working with the person uh, <laughs> so far I don't think I have maybe maybe the crime the crime <laughs> okay okay is there any special message you want to give out to fans out there and everybody watching this I don't know whether I have fans but to my friends and to people who work in the industry I think we have a long way to go and then we need God's guidance and support. So I think uh, we will get there. Massive shout out to everybody watching these at home and everywhere you are. Don't forget it's Trick Baby in fact, and this is Music Police on the XY Planet. Big shout out to Zaga who's on the camera and Zushi who's got us looking on flick. Your sky for this week and it's gonna be next week. I know you're thinking, but don't worry, you'll find out. On XY Planet, keep it locked. Damn.